Here are some Java IDE improvements of Eclipse 202309, including Maven, Web and General improvements. Improvements that have been added since the last release in June 2023, three months ago. Support for Java 21, which will be released one week after this Eclipse release, is not yet built in. But the preview can be installed via the Eclipse Marketplace probably soon. There are a couple of helpful improvements in the Java editor. You can now hover binary, octal and hex format numbers to get the decimal and hex values. This also works for double hex number constants. Upgrading deprecated method calls can be pretty easy. Hit Ctrl-1 and choose Replace with inlined method. That's it. This new quick assist is provided for deprecated methods if and only if the Java doc description for what to use instead refers to a method that is also actually used in the method body. That's clever, isn't it? The convert to lambda expression quick fix has been improved. It now simplifies the lambda expression to a method reference, if possible. The same can be done via source, cleanups, In the Java Feature tab, in the Java 8 section, make sure that the checkbox Convert Functional Interface Instances and the new checkbox Simplify Method Reference Syntax for Lambda Conversions are both ticked. Voila! The anonymous class has been simplified to a method reference. When comparing Java files, The Ignore White Space option no longer ignores white space changes in strings and text blocks, as they can alter the behavior of the code. The built-in Maven tooling has been improved for better user experience as well. In the POM editor, code completion for dependencies is now amazingly fast. especially when you use it again, thanks to the caching of previous Maven Central search results. Versions are now as they should be, in descending order, with the latest version on top and without duplicates. In the right click, Code Actions menu, refactorings for Maven properties are offered. Extract all values as new property in current module, or in parent to extract equal versions to the same property. Inline all properties does the reverse. Inline properties replaces only the current instance. and so on. That's nice, isn't it? A general feature, independent of the programming language you use, is that in the Project Explorer, you can now select more than one folder containing an Eclipse subproject. Right-click and choose Import as Project. Eclipse Wild Web Developer, which is included in the Eclipse IDE for Enterprise Java and Web Developers, and otherwise can be installed as done here, provide support for the latest web technologies. This includes support for the JavaScript TypeScript libraries React and Angular, and now also for Vue.js. Syntax highlighting, validation, and more. TypeScript is supported up to version 5.1 and there are a couple of minor improvements for TypeScript and JavaScript. For example, the fact that a function without return statements implicitly returns undefined is now correctly handled. No more errors for missing returns.
these were some of the Java IDE improvements of the quarterly rolling release September 2023. Thanks for watching and happy coding!